Bluegrass is a staple sound in parts of Tennessee. Hardin County and Savannah, Tennessee are some of those places. The area continues to bring the music to life through the 42nd Annual Bluegrass Festival. It's the 42nd Annual Bluegrass Festival. Uh, obviously, Mr. Wayne Geralds heads that up every year, and he's a, he's a staple in the bluegrass world and a staple in Hardin County and Savannah. The festival started in the late 70s to honor bluegrass musicians. Now it has become an annual tradition to many. Wayne Geralds began the festival and invited well-known musicians to be a part of it. Some of the biggest names in bluegrass, the father of bluegrass, Bill Monroe, we've had Jim and Jesse and, and the Osborne several times. The event is usually the weekend of the 4th of July, but due to COVID-19 concerns, they moved it to September and condensed it to one day but they are glad the tradition continues. Very happy to continue the tradition. We were very blessed that we're able to keep our outdoor events going. Uh, the Bluegrass Festival being one of them and because that's a very large draw for Savannah. The festival will be at the Savannah Market on Saturday and across the street, the Catfish Derby and the National Catfish Championship will be going on as well. Imani Williams for 39 News in Savannah.